morning, everybody. Get our angle right here. Happy Sunday. Oh, a little 16 minute yoga sculpt. Well, not really a little 16 minute yoga sculpt. All righty. Our speaker's not really wanting to work today, so we're gonna use my laptop. Hopefully y'all can hear this, okay? I'll turn it up, obviously, when we get started. Welcome. I will put our title here as well. Happy Sunday, y'all. Uh, putting our title. At home Yoga Sculpt. Right. All right. We are going to hope that Instagram doesn't hate us today. And it's going to be great. I'm going to close this door behind me and just realize it's open. Perfect. So this will be saved to my, obviously my Instagram and my website, my YouTube, all the things, but I always love it when y'all can join live. It's just, it's way more fun. You know what I mean? So thank you for being here. Um, if anyone's new to sculpt, what yoga sculpt is, is yoga with weights. So I'm using a pair of five pound weights. Usually I will use two sets, like a heavy and a light set. Uh, but this is just all I had today. So use whatever you have on hand. That's totally great. You can always alternate between heavier <clears throat> heavier weights and heavier weights and lighter weights if that feels good. Um, if you want to amplify or modify any exercises, and I'm gonna be going through class with y'all, so just take a peek at me. Um, we'll be kind of moving to the side of our space. So I'm gonna do the best to kind of like show y'all what we're doing um, in my own space, which is obviously a little bit more challenging when we're on our phones. But um, anyways, so I'm going to. Yay! Good morning, Jackie. I'm so glad you're here. I kind of the last minute decided to do this because we had family in town for. Um, for Thanksgiving and then everyone left yesterday and I was like, you know what, let's do a sculpt. So anywho, thank you for being here. And I'm going to turn off the comments for now, just because then y'all can see my, my mat obviously back here. And we are gonna get started in just one second. So yeah, make sure y'all have your weights. Weights are totally optional. Make sure you have maybe a towel to towel off. It's gonna get a little sweaty, um, water, all that good stuff. And I'll pull up our playlist here. I'll turn off the music once we get started as well. Um, but hopefully y'all are having a good Sunday so far. Yesterday we put up all of our Christmas decorations, so I feel like I'm really getting in the spirit, finally. Um, and alrighty guys, I think we're ready. So, oops, make sure I didn't miss anything. Okay, we're gonna get started on our backs today. So y'all are gonna start in what's called a Supta Baddha Kanasana. It's a butterfly pose on your back. So you press the soles of your feet together. Let your knees fall out nice and wide and just lay down on your back. You can let your low back release up off the earth. You can place one hand on your heart, one hand on your belly. Shut down your eyes. Just take a few moments here, guys, to arrive in your space. Taking big, deep breaths in through your nose and big open mouth exhales out through your mouth. Again, the soles of your feet pressed together, your knees fall nice and wide. You find that nice stretch in your inner thighs. Together, we like to start our practice, guys, with a big deep breath in through our nose together. Inhale. Big open mouth exhale, letting it go. Sighing something out. Another breath through, guys, in through your nose here, fill up. Take a big open mouth exhale, letting something go. Sighing it out, staying on your back here. Taking a few moments, like I said, to arrive in your space. Bringing it top of mind any sort of intention. Maybe it's a mantra, it's a word, a phrase. Anything that's really speaking to y'all this weekend, this holiday week, that you would like to use to power you through your practice. And of course, this week, I've been focusing a lot on gratitude. I've been sharing this with my in-person classes here at Core Power. And that is really, you know, taking that sort of theme of gratitude for this week and they came about it from a little bit different perspective, and that is how maybe we're going about our life from more of a scarcity mindset than an abundance mindset. So gratitude is really tapping into that abundance mindset. So this coming week, we're kind of shifting that, that focus, that perspective, that internal talk from I don't have enough time, I don't have enough in general, enough energy, whatever it is, to I have all the time in the world, I'm able, I'm capable. So really setting that intention with your practice here today, guys bringing it into this new week ahead, this upcoming new month. Whether it's this intention or your, your own, breathe it in here, take a big deep breath in. A 
a big open mouth exhale, letting it go. You're staying on your back for now. Just begin to bring a little bit of life back into your body. You wiggle your fingers, you can wiggle your toes, you can rock your chin from one shoulder to the other. Breathing in here, big open mouth exhales. When y'all are ready, come into a happy baby. So you grab the inner or outer arches of your feet. You press your feet up towards the sky as you actively pull down with your hands. Option to sway side to side. You can stretch one leg long, then the other. Happy baby. Taking a big deep breath into your nose. Big exhale out. Warming up that low body, finding any tension here, breathing into it. And four. And three, I'll place your feet into the earth. And two, press your low back down. Basic crunches, elbow fly. You lift and lower. You lift and lower. Coming right into a basic crunch. Knees right over your ankles. Elbows wide. Gaze is high towards the ceiling. Lift and lower. No space to your low back in the mat for eight, seven, six, and five. Arms come along. And four. And three, arms long, you reach out and in, and two, side of, and out of those knees, and one, arms are long, you reach out and in, out and in. Shoulders hover, gaze is high, release that tension in your neck for four, and three, and two, just pulse to the center, guys, and one, arms are long, pulse between your knees, pull up, pull up, gaze stays high, low back down, warming up our core for our hour here, and four, and three, grab behind your thighs. And two. And one, y'all, grab behind your thighs. Rock and roll up the length of your spine a couple of times. Release your low back. Gain a little bit of momentum. When you have it here, shift forward into a hand, knees, tabletop. Oof. We'll step back, y'all. Stack your shoulders right above your wrists. Hips come right above your knees. Tabletop back. Inhale to a cow pose. Drop your belly down. Your gaze comes high. Exhale, press the earth away. Dome up your spine, gaze towards your navel. Cat pose. Inhale, cow, drop your belly down. Your gaze comes high. Exhale, cat, dome up your spine. Again, gaze towards your belly button. Press the earth away. When you're ready, I'll come back to a hands and knees tabletop. Nice flat back. Stretch your right arm forward. Stretch your left leg back. We pulse, lift. Pulse, lift. I'll go to the side. Y'all can see just tiny squeezes. Left glute, right shoulder. Pulse, pulse. For four. Here for three. And two, we switch. And one, y'all, right leg, left arm, pulse, pulse. Squeezing out that glute, just warming up that shoulder. Micro bend your elbow for four, three. And two, back to tabletop, guys. And one, tabletop back. Tuck your toes under. Hovering tabletop, squeeze your belly button back towards your spine. Inhale here. Exhale, downward facing dog. Downward dog, walk it out here, guys. Stretch one leg long. Then the other, nice, strong down dog. Warming it up here, take a big deep breath in. Big exhale out. Down dog for four. Three, high plank, and two. And one, shift forward, guys, to your high plank. Shoulders stack over your wrist, belly button drives back to your spine, hips in line with shoulders. Slow mountain climbers to start. You drive your knee to chest back. Knee to chest back, slow, in. Step back, in, step back. Slow down climbers to start. We're gonna speed it up, coming up. Enjoy this slow pace. You're really strengthening that core here for eight, seven, six. Slow mountain climbers, guys. Five, we speed it up. In four, just one set of mountain climbers. Three, and two, you speed it up. And one, mountain climbers, drive it in, in. A little bit faster pace. Really drive your belly button back to that spine, guys. Here for four, three, plank jacks, and two. And one little cardio first. I know, jack out, out. Option here, step it side to side, plank step out. Toe tap here, you can go out. With both feet, plank jacks. Taking big breaths in. One last set, you're here for eight, seven, Five, downward dog, and four, three, two, and one, guys, downward facing 
dog. So well deserved. Take a big deep breath in. Big exhale out, let it go. Look towards the top of your space when y'all are ready. Take tiny baby steps. Feet knees the back of your wrists. Heel toe your feet together. Keep a little bit of space between your heels. Rising up one vertebrae at a time, nice and slow. Shake it out at the top. Catch your breath, keep your head above your heart. Inhale when you're ready, we can hit a mountain pose. Fingertips come up towards the sky. Slide your shoulders down your back. Catch your breath here again. Belly button back to spine. Lift your thighs up off your kneecaps. Take a big deep breath in. Exhale, baby back bend. Now shine your heart forward. Find that stretch across your chest. Inhale back to mountain pose. Exhale, hinge at your hips forward. Fold. Bend down, bend your knees. Inhale up to a halfway lift. Gaze this down, bodies in that nice number seven. Press into your shins. Inhale here. Woo. Exhale, high to low plank, chaturanga. Hands into the earth. Come down no more than halfway, elbows back. Inhale, upward facing dog. Lift your thighs off the earth. Exhale, downward facing dog. Hips high. Inhale, guys. Look toward the top of your space. Exhale, make your way to the top. Step, hop, or flip. Inhale, halfway lift. Gaze down. Exhale, forward fold. Dive it low. Inhale, root rise, mountain pose. Nice, strong posture here. Nice, slide your shoulders down your back. Inhale. Exhale, baby back bend. Find that nice stretch across your chest. Inhale, back to mountain pose. Exhale, guys, dive down forward, full hands through heart center. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, step it back, high to low plank, chaturanga. Come down, elbow shoot back, nice narrow grip. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. One last time through, look toward the top of your space, dog. Exhale, make your way there, step, hop, or float. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, root your eyes. Last time to start, sun A. Take a big deep breath in, mountain pose. Exhale, baby back breath. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, forward fold, dive low. Inhale, halfway lift. And exhale to your chaturanga, high to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. When you're ready, guys, look towards the top of your space. We're adding on for our sun B. Look towards the top of your space. Exhale, make your way there. Inhale, up to a halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, chair pose. Woo, if you've been here before, you know you guys like to get nice and low in our chair. Squeeze your inner thighs together. Weight is back in your heels. So you can wiggle your toes as a that little reminder. Take a big deep breath and get one inch lower. Inhale. Exhale, guys. Chair with your airplane arm. So you sweep your triceps back. Thumbs play, go down towards the earth. Pinkies up towards the sky. Inhale, back to your chair pose. Exhale, forward fold, dive low. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, chaturanga, high to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, guys, right leg high. Really square off your right hip, or squeeze your right glute. Take a big deep breath in, square off your hips, inhale. Exhale, right knee, right tricep. Right into those windshield wipers. You bring it left tricep, right tricep for four. And three, really squeeze into that core, guys, two. And one, inhale, right leg high. Exhale, guys, send it on through, low lunge, step between your hands. Inhale, crescent lunge. You get low in your legs, pause here. Front knee stacks over that front ankle. Spike up to the back ball mount of your back foot. Hips are square to the top of your space. Inhale. Exhale, open up to the side. Warrior two on facial feet so you can see. Heel to arch alignment with your feet. You are low in your lunge. Super active arms. Inhale, reach up and back, reverse warrior. Find that stretch in your front oblique. Exhale, chaturanga. Hands come into your earth. I know I'm facing the side. High to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale when you're ready, left leg high. Find that squeeze in your left glute. Inhale here. Exhale, left knee, left tricep. Windshield wiper, side to side. Right, left, right, left, four. Three, left leg high in two. And one, y'all. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, step it on through low lunge. Step between your hands. Inhale, crescent lunge. Get low in your legs. Exhale, open it up, warrior two. Get nice and low in your lunge. Gaze over your front fingertips. Inhale, reach up and back. Reverse warrior, super light back hand, no weight in the back. Inhale here. Exhale, y'all chatter and ronda high. Two low, plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. 
So get big breath in, y'all toward the top of your space. Exhale, make your way to the top. Inhale up to a halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, get low in your chair. Chair pose here. Again, pinky spiraling, really strong core. Inhale. Exhale, chair with airplane arms. Add a tiny pull to your triceps. Pulls up, up. Pinkies up towards the sky. You pull, lift, lift. Your gaze is a couple feet in front of your space. Just really warming up the backs of our arms. Here for eight. Pull. Seven. Keep pulsing. Sit your low in those legs. Five. And four. Three. Chair pose in two. And one, guys. Inhale, chair. Exhale, dive in low forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. And exhale, chaturanga, high to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Big breath in here, guys. Shift forward, high plank hold. Eight. And seven, holding our high plank for six. And five, downward facing dog. And four, strongest high plank. Three. And two, down dog. And one, y'all, downward facing dog. We have one more time through with weight. So toward the top of your space. Exhale, make your way to the top step, hop or flip. Inhale, halfway lift. Ooh. Exhale, dive down forward, we'll grab your light set of weights or whatever weight you're using. Inhale, press your weights above your shoulders, chair pose. Exhale, chair with airplane arms to your triceps back, get low in your legs, we pulse those arms. Up, pulse up. You've been here before. This time we're just adding in weights, finding that squeeze, they're tiny pulses. Really isolating the backs of your arms, not here long in four. We're here for three, all weights to heart center. And two, we pulse our legs low. And one, weight to heart center, pulse your legs down. Pulse down. Yes, weight back in your heels. Chest stays proud. Get low in your legs, pulse those inner thighs. Down and down. Nod here long. We pulse for four, three, and two, and one. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, dive down, forward fold. Ditch your weights, let them go. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, step it back to a chatter on the high to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. I know we have a lot of these to start. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, right leg high, guys. Exhale, right knee, right tricep, no windshield wipers. Inhale, right leg back high. Exhale, send it through low lunge. Lunge, really out of your weights. Inhale, cross at lunge, pressure weights above your shoulders. Exhale, open up to your warrior two. Bend your elbows, arms in a W. Inhale, press up, reverse warrior. Exhale, guys, pull, pivot. Plant your weights down, high plank hold. We have shoulder taps. We tap right and left. Tap right and left. Quick transitions, I know. Really drive your belly button back to your spine. You tap right and left. Tap right and left. Just four, three, and two. Down dog in one. Downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg high, guys. Exhale, left knee, left tricep. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, step it on through low lunge. Grab your weights. <sighs> Inhale, cross the lunge. Pressure weights up. Exhale, open up to the side of your space. Warrior two, bend your elbows. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, pull. Pivot. Plant your final chaturanga for now. High to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Okay. Shift it forward. Take a second on your knees if you need it. We have one set of wide arm push ups. This is it for our wide arm push ups of class. Hands come to the wide, wide edges of your face, wide arm push ups. Let's go. We lower down, lift, low, lift. Option come down to your knees. Heels come up towards your glutes. Lower, lift, low, lift. Elbows, guys, come right over those wrists. Down and up. One to the wide arm push ups. Lower, press the earth away. Find your exhale as you press for four. I know. Three quick sets. Forearm plank in two. Only forearm plank of our practice today. We hold. Forearm plank. Meet me here. Yes, you can. Hips and line your shoulders. Then you place your palms up towards the sky. We hold for four. Three, 30 seconds, guys. And two, hips it. And one, let's go. It's right, center, left, center. Hover that hip. Dip it right, center, left, center. Hip dip here, dip right, and left. Last set, here for eight, 
seven, we're warming up those obliques, six. In five, this is it, your knees in four, finish it out, three, two, and one, come down to your knees, guys. Whew, okay, we're cruising. Take a sec, towel off if you need it, take a little some water. We're getting right into some bicep work here, grab your heavy set of weights, stay on your knees. Stay on your knees. Whew, grab your heavy set of weights. Bring your elbows to your side body. Palm is face up towards the sky. Basic bicep curl. We lift and lower. Lift and lower. If you have a heavier set of weights, I challenge you to take them here. Exhale, lift. Exhale, lift. Slow and controlled. Slide your shoulders down your back. Here for eight. Seven. Six. In five, yes, you can. Let's go. You're here for four. Three, we take it to a pulse. Into elbows, 90 degree bends. Here we go. We pulse up, up. 90 degree bend in those arms. Tiny pulses in your bicep. Shake out those shoulders, that neck. Here for four. Three, serving trade. And two, just eight count. And one, we start at our side. We press out, pull back. Press out. And back, palms are up. Option, go one arm at a time. Here for four, three, and two, hammer curl. And one, your palms are in, we lower down, lift. Hammer curls, option guys, you're gonna hinge back to light up your quad, squeeze your core, or you can add that glute hover. Elbows stay your side body, you want a little bit more. Option, you just really focus on your upper body. It's up to you. Find your breath. Palms are in. Numbers on your waist. Face up towards your shoulders. In four. Three. We're back to those pulses, guys. In two. And one. 90 degrees. You pulse up. Up. Find that tension in your bicep. Squeeze. Squeeze. Yes. You serve a tray. In two. What am I saying? Here we go. In two. And one. Now we serve that tray, guys. Press out. Pull back, out, and back, out, squeeze. Quick, set, and four, three, wide arm curls, guys, two. And one, elbows to your side body, lower down, exhale, lift. No pulses here, enjoy this full range. Find your breath, exhale, lift, inhale, lower. You lower, exhale, lift, lower, exhale, lift. Arms are at that angle, guys, here for eight. And seven, maybe add that glute hover here. Six, five, and four, W press. And three, just one quick set, and two. And when your arms at your side body press, up, pull down. Serving out to the side, press out, pull back. I know, press, and pull. Four, three, and one, set your weights down, guys. All right, shake out your upper body. Make your way up to standing. Take a little bit of water, towel off if y'all need it. We have a fun little low body sequence. Shaking out your arms. Meet me up at standing. Hips, feet are a little bit wider than hip width distance. Weight comes back in your heels. Starting with a basic squat. You lower down and lift. Lower and lift. We're shifting our focus into our low body. Chest stays proud, shoulders slide down your back, lower, exhale, lift, lower, lift. Really squeeze your glutes at the top. In eight, seven, like you're sitting back in that chair, six, in five, we have a toe tap just to the right, and four, weight is in that left foot. Three, toe tap to the right, and two, and one, get low in your left leg, guys, we tap right, Center, right, center, slow, right, center, right, center. In four, and three, we keep this step out, guys, we turn into a squat, here we go. In one, watch me, to step out, squat, you step out, right, center, step right, and center, just like that toe tap, but now you're adding that step out, squat. You step right, center, right, center. Yes. Really light touches on that right foot here for eight. In seven. Six, 
keep the step out squat. In five is one step out squat. In four, one reverse lunge. In three, we start with a step out squat. In two, whoo, in one, starting with that step out squat, you step right, center, reverse lunge, center, right, center, reverse lunge, center. In four, quick set. In three, toe tap, left leg. And two, other side, guys. In one, get low in your right leg, tap left, center, left, center. Catch your breath, get low in that right leg, tap, in, four, three. Turn this into that step out squat, guys. Two on the left. In one, stay low in that right leg, step, left, center, left, center. Light touches with that left leg, guys. Y'all know where we're going. Eight. Seven. Six. In five, we add that reverse lunge in four. In three, add your reverse lunge, guys. In two, start with that step out squat. In one, here we go. We step out left, center. Reverse lunge, center. Step left, center. Reverse lunge, cover that knee. Let's go. In four. Three, back to full range squats. In two, even out both legs. In one, shake it out, guys. Full range, be lower and lift. Yes, down, squeeze, lower, squeeze, lift, lower, squeeze, lift. Here for four, shaking it out in three, Woo, two, and one. All right, shake out your low body. Have fun. All right, take some water and towel off. Grabbing our heavy set of weights. Next, we're into a little bit of shoulders and back. So grab your heavy set of weights. Feet come about hip width distance, or you can come into your chair pose. Hinge your chest forward. Weights come in front of you. Tuck your pelvis under. Narrow rows. We pull back, lower down. Pull back, lower down. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Tucking your pelvis under to protect your low back. Nice show. If this is better from that chair pose, go for it. Or if that feels better on your low back to bring a little bit wider stance, go for it here. Last set option to go one arm at a time. Here for eight. Woo, seven. Six. In five, one set. In four, a reverse line. Guys, three arms long. In two. In one, one set. Let's go. Fly. Lower down. Lift. Lower, you can always go one arm at a time. Pulling back, lower down. Four, three, stand it up. In two, upright row. In one, y'all, upright row, stand it up. You squeeze, lift, low. Elbows come wide, weights up in line with shoulders. Micro bend your knees. Exhale, lift, exhale, lift. Option to go one arm at a time always. Taking whatever your body needs today, exhale, lift. Exhale, let's come back to that intention. Come back to your breath. Let it drive these movements. Four. Three, we pulse at the top. And two elbows stay high. And one hold at your highest point, pulse up. Up, just a couple inches up. Let's go, you squeeze, lift. Light up your chest, your shoulders here in four. Three, front raise in two, one more change, this is it. And one, start low. We squeeze weights up to shoulder height. Exhale, lift. Bring it up, lower down. Go one arm at a time. Shoulders probably talking to you here. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower, lift. Lower your core is engaged, guys. Final eight. Seven. Six. Five. Let's go for four. Three. And two. And one, set your weights down. Take a step. Again, a little sip of water. We have one set of cardio. Getting right into it. The cross country skier, shake it out. Here we go. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Cross country skier. Bring it nice and long. Woo, okay. You're right into that cross country skier. Keep it up here. We have two minutes of cardio. Finding your big breath in. Your big open mouth exhale. We're gonna face the side of your mat next. In four, face the side in three, jumping jacks. 
in two, face the side in one, guys, jumping jacks, let's go, out, out, Woo. jumping jacks, option is stepping out side to side, go step right, left, up to you, Woo. big legs here, final set, eight, seven, six, five, face the front, guys, in four, And two high knees. And one face knee, high knees. Drive your knees up. Yes. You can always slow it down. It's up to you. You're driving your knees to your chest. We're here for four. And three, jump your rope. And two. And one, just jump your rope. Shake it out, catch your breath. Just jump rope side to side. Woo. Okay, jump rope. Here for four, guys. And three. Opposite elbow into opposite knee. Now that little skip, using that core, drive it in. In. Opposite elbow, opposite knee. Find that pace. Have a little fun with it. Using your low abs to drive that knee high. Bring it in. In. Woo! Final set. Eight. Here for seven. Six. And five. We face the other side, guys. Four. And three, last set. Jumping jacks in two. This is it. Our one last change in one. Face the other side. Out. Out. Jumping jacks. Last big cardio burst of your class. Maybe take those star jumps. Woo, you're feeling ambitious. Nice, guys. Only a few more. Find your press. You're here for four. Three, face the front. And two. And one, face the front of your face. Take a sec. Keep your head above your heart. Woo! I am out of breath. <laughs> okay, grab your heavy set of weights. We have a little active recovery. Our sculpt sides today are super, super fast. Quick. So grab your weights, get right into it. Meet me here. Feet a little bit wider than hip width distance. Press your weights together. Drive your elbows in, biceps from your face, tricep extensions. Tuck your pelvis under again. To really protect your low back. Squeeze your core. We lift and lower. Bringing that focus back to our triceps. Biceps frame your face. Tuck that pelvis under, bend your knees slightly. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower. Nice, y'all. Keep that chin off your chest, protect that neck for eight, seven, six, and five. Quick pulse in four, yes you can. In three, one and only pulse, guys, two. And one, we pulse it up, lift, lift those weights, lift, and lift. Couple inches up, shut your eyes, we're here for four. In three, yes you can guys, just two. In one, weights back to heart center, shake out that upper body. Inhale, drive your left leg high, left leg high, inhale. Exhale, send it back, low lunge. Bring your chest forward, shoulders right above your hips, right into that lunge. Lower, exhale, lift. Lower, exhale, lift. Option to add that bicep curl. Everything lowers, everything lifts. Front knee tracks over. That front ankle. That back knee hovers. We lower and lift. Lower and lift. Weights can always come to heart center. Take out those arms. Last eight. Seven. Six. Five. Press it, lunging. Four. Three, press your weights up. And two. And one, y'all. Inhale, press the lunge, press your weights above your shoulders. Big breath in. Exhale, open up to the side of your space. I'm gonna face y'all so you can see. You're low in your legs. Inhale, up to your star pose. Heels and toes out, make a big X with your body. Inhale, exhale, down to your horse. Weights to heart center, be pulse it low. Down, down. Back is flat, pelvis tucked. Protect your low back. A lot of people sit their booties back. Instead, stack your shoulders directly above your hips like you're sliding up and down a wall. Your back is flat as a board. We pulse for eight. Seven, lighting up those inner thighs. Six, those outer glutes. In five, we stay low in our legs. In four. And three, oblique twist. And two, weight stand heart center. And when low body does not move, we twist front, center, back, center, front. And back, I know I'm facing the front, y'all are facing the side of your space. You twist front, 
center, back, center, last eight. This is it. Seven. Six, low body does not move. Five, avoid that turn of your knee, guys. Four. Three, twisting with those obliques in two. And one, star pose, heels and toes out, guys. Exhale, I'll come back to me, y'all. Warrior two, just find your space. Inhale, press up, reverse warrior. Exhale, pull, pivot. Plant your weights down, option to take a chaturanga. If you want it, or just come to your knees. If you want the chaturanga, take it. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Come down to your knees when you're ready. Okay, hands to tabletop. Grab one heavy weight if you want it, optional always. Place it right behind your right knee. Hands knees tabletop. Drive your right leg high, donkey kicks lower and lift. All face the side so y'all can see better. You lower, lift, lower, lift. If this is ever too much for those wrists, come down to that left forearm, press your right hand into the earth. Nice. Full range, donkey kicks, flex that foot. Bring your right heel as tight to your right glute as you possibly can. Gaze down, protect your neck. I know it's really tempting to look up. You're gonna take me tomorrow when your neck does not hurt. Find your flex in that right foot, that squeeze in that right center glute. Knock your long. Four. Three, fire hydrants, guys. And two, we open to the right. And one, fire hydrants, lift and lower, lift. And lower, bring that right knee up in line with your right hip. You exhale, squeeze, inhale, lower. Exhale, squeeze. Now we're shifting that focus to that right outer glute. Eight, seven, six, and five. Hold that right leg high, guys, four. We have one more change. In three, quick set. And two, we circle it out. And one, hold that right leg high. We circle around for two, around for two. You bring that knee in big circles. Open to that right in four. And three, we switch the left side, guys, in two donkey kicks. And one, grab that weight, place it behind your left knee. Reset here, hands, knees, tabletop. Left leg high, heel in towards your glute. Donkey kicks, lower down, exhale, lift. Lower, exhale, lift. Find your breath. Find that squeeze in that left center glute. Eight, seven, six, and five. Microbend those elbows, guys. Four, gaze down. And three, fire hydrants, two. And one, let's go. You squeeze that left knee up. Lower, lift, lower. Same thing, left side. Giving it just as much attention. Bringing that left knee up in line with that left hip. Lift, lower, nice y'all. Last set, eight, seven, six. You'll know where we're going. In five, you have that quick set. In four of those circles. In three, just eight counts. In two, keeping that left knee high. In one, start at the top. And bring it around for two around for two big circles with that left knee flex that left foot guys you're here for four this is it in three yes you can just two in one. Oh my god drop your weight for a sec all right we have one more song on our knees shaking out those glutes for a sec we have one more again song on our knees get your weight out of your way we don't need it for now no weights for this then we're back to the other side, which now we know is super, super quick. Starting with your hands right underneath your shoulders. Whew. Shifting forward on your knees, right into a tricep push-up. You lower for two. Exhale, lift. For two, your elbows graze your side body. Your gaze is down. Nice, narrow grip. We lift for two and lower for two. Option to take these slower tricep push-ups. Hands are right underneath your shoulders. You get so much easier the more you practice. We lower down for two. Lift for two. Elbows shoot back. They graze your side body. Tuck your core in, guys. We are not here long. Last set. Lower down for two. Press lift for two. These are so effective. Burning out those triceps. Here for four. 
In three, I'll child's pose. In two. In one, stretch out those arms. Stretch out your triceps, child's pose. Sink your hips back. Take a step. Woo, when you're ready, shift it back. Come stay on your knees. Bring your arms long on your face. On your knees, arm circle. Bring it around. Lift. Around. Pause. Around. Pause. Meet me here. Slow lift. Slow lift. No weights for these arms. I've been doing these in my classes and I've heard this is harder than the actual weights. So meet me here. Really sculpting out that upper body around. Pause. Around. Pause. Slide your shoulders down. We're circling to the front. We're going to go to the back after this. In four. Three. To the back. In two. In one, reverse your circle. Bring it back. Pause. Back. Pause. Staying on those knees, guys. Your core's engaged. Arms stay long. It's back. Pause. Back. Pause. Here for eight. Seven, I know, starting to burn. Six. And five, we have a quick, quick little shake out in four. And three. And two. Woo! And one, now shake out your arms real quick. Then bend your elbows, goal pose. In and out. In and out. 90 degree bend. Elbows stay in line with shoulders. If you ever need to take a quick little shake out, go for it here. Then get right back in. 90 degree bend option here, warm at a time. We have a couple more changes. Nod your lungs, slide your shoulders back and down. Nice y'all. Eight, seven, six, quick shake out. In five, then arms back long in four. And three, shake it out, then to an over, under, and two. And one, shake it out. When you're ready, arms are long, guys. Palms back, palms up. Over unders, you're making that big C shape with your arm. Bring it back. Lift. Back. Lift. Fingertips long. Just eight. Seven. Six. One more change. Five. You're gonna bend our elbows in. Four. Three. W press in. Two. And one. Elbows your side body, guys. Press up. Pull back. Up. Pull back. Remember we did those serving trays out to the side? Same thing here. Just no weight. Burning out that upper back. Those shoulders, those biceps. Final eight. Yes, you can. Seven. Six. Create that tension. Five, that resistance. Let's go in four. Three. Just two. In one, you'll shake out your arms. Whew. Really amazing how challenging it is without weight. Okay, shake out your arms. You did it. Absolutely amazing job. We're so close. We have one more sculpt side, which as y'all know is super quick. And then we're on our backs for two more working songs. So grab your weight. Meet me back up and standing. Last time in your chair pose today. Grab your weight. Active recovery here. Press your weights above your shoulders. Get low with your legs. Inhale. I still chair with the airplane arm. Oh, kind of hot. Try to kick backs right into it. You lower down, exhale, lift. Lower, exhale, lift. Weight to your side body, guys. Find your exhale at the top. You lower, press, lower, press. Yes. Find that squeeze. You lower, exhale, lift. Lower, exhale, lift. Gaze a couple feet in front of your space to protect your neck. Really burning out the back of those arms, guys. We're so close. You're cruising through this class. We're here for eight, seven, six, and five. Take it to a pulse and four. Three, just one pull, shell two. And one, weights high, we pull for eight. Seven, yes, you can, let's go. Six, five, you're here for four. Three, take it to one. We stand it up, weights. Forward center, guys. Inhale, right leg high. Take a big deep breath in, right leg high. Exhale, send it back, low lunge. Chest comes proud, shoulders right above your hips, right into that lunge. Lower, exhale, lift. Lower, exhale, lift. Option, add your hammer curl. Lower, lift. Everything lowers and everything lifts. You hover that back right knee. Left knee stays tracked over that left ankle. 
final set of your lunge. Eight, seven, six, and five. Crescent lunge in four. Yes, three, and two, and one. Y'all inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, ocean up to the side. Warrior two. Get low in your legs again. I'm gonna face y'all so you can see. Inhale to a star pose. Whew, heels and toes out, take a big breath. Exhale, maybe down your horse. We're back to those pulses, pull down. Inner thighs light up, outer glutes. Squeeze. Quick set of pulses. Four. Three, weights behind your thighs. And two, your oblique dips. And one, we start it to the front. Lower, lift, lower, lift. Yes. Back, center, front, center. Using those obliques to pull you back up. Low body dunk up move. Eight, seven, six, and five. Pulse it to the front in four. Three, all quick pulse. And two to the front. And one, pulse it to the front for four. Squeeze your core. Three, add that crunch. Yes, two to the back. And one, pulse to the back. Let's go for four. Three, star pose in two. And when you'll grab your weights, inhale, star pose. Exhale, warrior, two to the front of your mat. Inhale, reverse warrior. And exhale, pull, pivot. Plant your weights down. Option to take that chaturanga. Or just meet me on your knees. Woo, maybe take your last and final chaturanga of your class. Inhale, up dog. Exhale. Woo, downward facing dog. Okay, guys. We have two more working songs. Some more glutes. A little bit more upper body with those glutes. And then core. Then we get a stretch. Grab your weights. Head to set of weights, optional always again. Meet me on your back. Stack your knees right over those angles. Place your heavy weights right on your hips, nice and light. Full range hip lifts, lift. And lower, you lift. And lower, exhale, squeeze. And exhale, squeeze. Nice, y'all. Last chance to burn out that low body today. Squeeze, hover your glutes at the bottom. Holding nice, guys. Your challenge here is to hover your glutes at the bottom every single time. Exhale, lift, and hover. Lift to the top, hover at the bottom. Find that pace. Let's go for eight, seven, six, and five, just four, three, we hold it at the top, and two, we pull. And one, by your highest point, you pull. Lift, pulse lift. Find that squeeze in your glutes, guys. Yes, press your shoulders into the earth. We're gonna hold at the highest point in four. And three, I'll grab your weight into skull crushers. And one, hips stay high, elbows in, you lower and lift. Skull crushers here. Elbows squeeze. Hover your weights right above your forehead, lower down. Exhale, lift. Lower, exhale, lift. Hover, extend. Low body's in that static pull for eight. Seven. And six, don't keep those weights in your hands. In five, we add a chest press. In four, with that hip lift. In three, turn this into a chest press. In two, with that hip lift. In one, your chest press, hip lift, we lift. Everything lower. Lift and lower. Hover your elbows right above the earth as you hover those glutes. Lower down. Lift and lower. 90 degree bend in those arms. Yes, y'all. Adding that chest press in with your hip lift. Last chance to really burn out that upper body and that lower body. We're into core after this. Find your breath. Last set, full range for eight. Seven, six, five, glutes at the top, and four, we pull. And three, your elbows are at the bottom, guys, hover. And two, everything pulses. And one, glutes high, elbows low, we pull up, pull up. Couple inches up with those elbows, couple inches up with those glutes. Pulse, pulse, for four, Three, just hold at the highest point in those glutes, guys, and two. And one, hover those elbows, hold for four. 
We hold for three, waist down. In two, in one, y'all set your waist down, bring it to the top of your space. We have one more working song. All right, meet me in your reverse tabletop. Your knees step right above your hips, flex your feet, elbows come wide. It's opposite elbow, opposite knee, yogi bicycle. Bring your legs back to that reverse tabletop every time. Twist, center, twist, center. Find your breath, twist, center. Thinking about bringing your elbow towards your knee rather than your knee towards your elbow. You don't want to light up those hip flexors. You want to use your core to really lift that shoulder, drive that knee to your opposite elbow. And four, and three, we pulse it to the right, and two. And one, bend that right knee, guys, hold, right, hold. Left leg long, hover above the earth, pulse, pulse, four, three, to the left, and two. And one, pulse it to the left for eight, seven, six, five, and four, rest your head next, three, and two guys, and one leg's long, we lower down for two, and lift for two, lower those legs, then lift them back up, lower down for two, lift for two, no space between your low back and mat. The second your low back wants to come up, bring those heels back high. It doesn't matter how low you get. It depends on really that tension in your core, guys. Find your breath. Just a few more of these. Lower and lift. You go down for two. Lift for two. Legs lower. Legs lift. Last set. Four. Three. Climb your rope in two. And when your legs are long, you reach your right, left. Climb your rope. Hover your shoulders. Let's go. Just four quick steps. Three. Basic crunch in two. And one. Elbows wide. Do exhale. Lift. Inhale. Lower. Lift. Lower. Just like we started our practice, our workout today. Exhale. Lift. And exhale. Lift. No space between your low back and mat, guys. We only have a couple more changes here. Yes, you can. Burning out that core in four. And three, elbows stay wide. And two, you pulse at the top. And one, pulse at the top for eight. Pulse. Seven, elbows stay wide. Six, low back down. And five, arms come long in four. And three, we reach out in and in two. And one, arms long, you reach out, in, out, in, this is it, this is how you end. Cover those shoulders, last four, three, and two, and one, guys, bring both knees in towards your chest, rock and roll up the length of your spine a couple of times, release your low back. When you're ready, stretch your arms and legs long, take a good morning stretch, let your low back release them off the earth. Really stretch out that core you just worked so hard. Absolutely amazing job. We have a nice quick little stretch, guys. A nice shavasana to enter into your Sunday. Take it for yourself. Okay, arms and legs come along. When you feel ready, bring both heels back and towards your glutes. Setting up for a supine figure four. So you cross your left, your right ankle rather, over your left thigh. Grab behind that left thigh, pull it in towards your chest. Press your right elbow into your right inner thigh to open up that hip. Flex your feet, holding this here, breathing in. That right side body, take a big deep breath in. Big exhale out. Take a big inhale, y'all. Exhale, switch, unwind, cross your left ankle over that right thigh. Supine figure four on this side. Go behind that right thigh, pull it in towards your chest. Press your left elbow into your left inner thigh to open up your hip. Quick stretch today, take a big inhale. Exhale, release, guys. Come into a happy baby. Grab the inner outer arches of your feet. Press your feet up towards the sky. As you pull down with those hands, option to stretch one leg long and the other. Big breath in. Big breath out. Swaying out side to side again. Releasing your hamstrings if that feels good. Last inhale. 
Exhale, release your hands from your feet. Come curl into one tight, tiny little ball. Push your forehead in towards your knees. Take a big inhale. Squeeze every single muscle in your face. Exhale, release. Come to your final resting pose. on your Shavasana. Stretch your arms and legs long. Nice, quick little Shavasana today. Shut down your eyes. Palms can face up towards the sky to receive some energy or down towards the earth to ground yourself. Coming back to that intention, that abundance mindset that y'all have cultivated for the last hour. Just taking a few moments of silence here, y'all, and I'll lead you out in just a sec. Take one last big final inhale here, guys, through your nose. Exhale out through your mouth. When you're ready, bring a little bit of life back into your body. Wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes. You can rock your chin from one, one shoulder to the other. When y'all feel ready, just make your way up to a nice, easy seat at the top of your space. Cross your ankles. Move to a nice, easy seat again. Shut down your eyes. Bring your hands back to heart center. Together, always like to end our practice just as you've begun. And take a big, deep cleansing breath in. Big open mouth, exhale out, let something go. Bring your thumbs up to your third eye center, y'all, when you're ready. The seat of your intuition, the light, the love, the student and teacher in me bows to and honors the light, the love, the student and teacher. And every single one of y'all bow forward as we say namaste. Namaste, guys. Happy Sunday. Thank y'all for being here. Um, and I will ooh, be saving this to my... Obviously, on Instagram, my site, all the good things. Um, so fun to have you guys. Amazing, Nora. I'm glad you were here. Gracie, awesome. Sydney, love it. Elaine, y'all are the best. So I'm going to save this, and I'm about to make my next sequence for December. So if y'all have anything you'd like to see in, in like a school class or don't, let me know. Um, but if y'all are in Austin, I teach twice a week at Core Power downtown. So um, it's fun to have a little chance to do them virtually as well. It's a little bit different setup, obviously, than like a heated yoga studio, but it's great. It's nice to do these while you're traveling or you just don't want to leave your house. So don't blame y'all. Caitlin, I'm so glad you're here. Yay, amazing. Um, well, thank y'all for being here. Happy kind of belated Thanksgiving. And I will definitely be doing another one leading up to the holidays. I feel like especially when you have people in town, it's nice to like have these at home when you don't, again, want to leave. But um, hopefully y'all have a great week. And thank y'all for being here. Happy Sunday. I'm going to go save this right now.